filling this thing up and see what the hell happens. Switch full. HHO's is running. So, it's going to be about 120 miles, so we'll find out today what the hell it's going to be doing. Yeah, well, uh, total Cadillac ride in the uh, Suzuki here. Uh, that's a major squeak going on. I don't even know if you can hear me over the wind noise, but uh, it stopped. It just kept going, man. I said, hell with it. <laughs> find out. It probably looks brighter on the camera than it is, but it's getting dark, so uh, out here in the country roads. But it seems like it's running good. Something was squeaking really loud, and I was like, I don't know what the hell it was, man, but I think it was the uh, heat riser thing on a manifold or something. Who knows? Maybe it fell off. Well, shit, I wasn't, <laughs> I wasn't recording. It's uh, four and a half gallons. So I, I, was, I was saying I didn't think it was going to do that good. Now I'm like saying, whoa, wait a minute. Four and a half gallons, because four gallons is um, 30 miles to the gallon. Uh, five gallons is 20, 20 miles, 25 miles to the gallon. So that's 27 and a half. And I was beating on it pretty good. That's pretty damn good. Holy shit. Still producing HHO good at a low idle. I don't know what was making noise. It might have been this thing here, like something. There was something on here that was squeaking before. Maybe some metal fell off. Uh, but anyway, just to sum it up, this has got the. Uh, it's got HHO. It's got its uh, 16 plate kit, and it's got the Toyota carburetor. And it's a remanufactured for 78 1200 Corolla. Uh, and it's got a K&N filter. So that was 27, 28 miles to the gallon. Pretty good. And it was not baby.